Hello everybody, Mikey Dare Panginator here with Hearts of Iron 4. The United Kingdom Monarchist Path, aka Let's Try and Murder Germany. Alright, so let's um First of all, we need to get some of these uh, airfields a little bit more up to par. Not nuclear. Okay, so we're building up our recon stuff. And what I decided to do was to um, kind of separate, segregate, um, se cut off all of these people, or put them in different armies. Oh shit, we lost Gibraltar. Um, guys, this is a this is a disaster. All of y'all need to take Gibraltar. Ow. Shit. <laughs> this is not good. Okay, so um, let's just say uh, don't go there. Or there. Or just don't go into the Mediterranean. Okay, so you mine layers. Yeah, um. Don't do that. Okay, the Mediterranean is a silly place. We should never go there. Oh, we can conquer Ecuador. That's good. Alright, so let's declare war. And then send in the paratroopers. And what we decided to do, or what I decided to do, I guess we, we as in King Edward and his lackeys, we are going to put the, um, what, they're, what are they called? The dudes into here. What decisions are it? No, we're not doing war propaganda. Um, got a lot of political power. So we're moving them here. Ready. And we're moving these people to the United Kingdom. Uh. As we are moving these people to the United Kingdom. We are going to launch as many divisions as possible. Well, not quite as many divisions as possible. So our naval invasion capacity is 150. Each army has 24. Let's just say that's 25. So let's just say 20. Um, that would be... Math, sorry. Hold up. <laughs> Basically, we have um, six armies of 24, which is almost 150. That is what's important. So there we go. We're uh, retraining everyone, trying to get everyone as experienced as possible for this naval invasion. We've also kind of separated them off and added a bunch more stuff. Okay. So we're building ships and everything, which is good and all. Building fleet destroyers. Who is needed? I think we just need like normal submarines too. Oh, we got a carrier we are not using. What do you need? Just regular destroyers? What about him? You're on patrol, but you're repairing. You're repairing. You're in Sussex. You're repairing. Okay, I think we could use more escorts. So let's go destroyer. Let's do that. Okay. So there we go. We're gonna um, kind of retrain everybody. And then we're gonna land in Germany. We're taking a lot of losses. Losing the army in Gibraltar wasn't great. If D-Day fails, which I fear that it might, we're foot slogging in. Um, we're foot slogging in Asia. However, it does appear we're moving forward in Asia. Oh my God! Come on, execute order 66. Let's go. Get them out of here. Strikes! Oh, great. So we have low stability. How do we improve stability? Is that improved? 
Worker conditions. How do we get more stability? Our war support's up, it's just our stability sucks. So, that ain't good. Let's get better anti-tank. And let's start researching self-propelled guns. I think we might need them at some point. Okay, so, um... Yeah, we'll see how all of this goes with all of these, like, potential encirclements and everything. Oh, ooh, look, we're, uh, we're down here. So let's secure Dalian or whatever. And then I'll uh, free up a lot of people over here. How is our retraining going? Okay, good. You're retrained. That's good. You're retrained, so the Black Army should be good to go. And even more ships. I'm just going to spam destroyers. Because I feel like that's <laughs> I feel like that's what's gonna help. Um, okay. So we got Yorkshire, Yorkshire, we got some Amtrak's coming. Alright, so all of you are here. Okay, so we're gonna separate off these Marines and just get them to hundred percent training. And your whole army needs to be retrained, so we're just gonna get that working. So that's good. Back to the Middle East, where we have apparently lost a division. That's not great. Alright, now... All of this is great and all, but like... What the hell is going on with this border gore? So we capitulate Manguko, but like... We got some wounded people. Yeah, I just think for some reason this is going to end up with us getting encircled. So, uh, this makes me uncomfortable. Like, very uncomfortable. Move into there. Damn, just all these destroyers. Alright, improved... Depth charges are great and all. I don't think we're actually going to need them. Let's get better close air support. More destroyers. There comes a point in every campaign where I go too far. I should just stop. I'm past that point. But the show must go on. I want to I wanna at least try to land. Try and see if I can't succeed in a D-Day landing. And if not, then we'll... Um, we will kindly move on to the next series. Nope, wrong one. There we go. Okay, all of you need to get back onto here. Alright, so, you're ready to go. You are almost ready to go. And then all of these, all of these are going to be put into the here. So we're going to move you to here for now. Improved anti-air upgrade, that's good. Doesn't this, um, doesn't this icon look like, uh, like punching into the sky? Like a fist punching the sky? Oh, we have some, uh, army experience, so we're gonna use that to our advantage. Put that to good use. Yeah, these empires just, these countries just get way too unwieldy. Like, as you get this big. Alright, so Centurion. Let's get armor. Reliability. Main gun. Reliability. Engine. So we can't get engine all the way up. Um. Drop reliability. Oh. So we can only get reliability up to 88%. Let's keep it at 70 something. Let's save that. Let's delete that. I really think it would be great. And I know there's been talks about this. If there were like a tank designer, just like there's a, a ship designer. I feel like that'd be pretty cool. That would go over well in my opinion. 
So there we go. Get the Marines involved. And then in Asia, who knows what the hell's happening in Asia. So it does seem like we are, um... Alright, so they are being pushed back, so y'all can do as you please. You already got that? That was fast. Huh. Interesting. So, what should we do? Do do do. Do 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 do. Get a f better carrier hull. I don't know. Just keep researching naval stuff. Who dares wins? Oh, you're gonna get you're gonna get cut off. Run away. This is you see this is what's stupid. Like, their country surrenders, and we get all this free land. It's, it's, yeah. Hearts of Iron breaks down. The later in the game you get. I mean that's fine, but. All right. So you. We're not ready. You're ready. You're ready. You're ready. You're ready. So we're waiting on this guy mainly. Despite the fact he's been leading these people, he sucks at his job. Breaking news, we're invading Ecuador. It may or may not work. We're also going to get the paratroopers involved in this. In this invasion. Why? Because I just realized we have paratroopers and they're useful for something. Oh, this looks like, uh, this looks bad. How many damn divi divisions do we have here? Oh, boy. How much manpower do you have? All adults serve. Hmm. Y'all have bad logistics, which makes no sense to me. Ours. Supported. Bottleneck is infrastructure in Dima. Which is where? Is that here? Get y'all a better port. Because I want to start... I just want to grind their band power down. That's how we're going to win. That's how we're going to win. Grinding their manpower down. Heroes, one and all. So, yeah, I was thinking about spinning our stability and... Glad we didn't because, well, that's why. Alright, we capitulated Ecuador. Got a bunch of free equipment out of it. That's cool. Okay. Hi, I'm Panzernator, and this is Jackass. So, D-Day. Hi. Okay. Um, I know we have some transport planes somewhere. Because I went through this list and I saw it. I don't know where to go. Where are the transports? Let's see. Because we're gonna... Here we go. Hi! Yes, you are... Going up to 500. And you're going up to here. Paratroopers! One and all. Um... I'm just gonna tell y'all to, um... Go there for now. So have fun. Enjoy your time. Because you going to die. Are there any of you fully trained? Not yet. You're still good. You're still training. 
Okay, so if our like super massive D D day doesn't work, I don't know, y'all. What the f fuck is happening here? Like nothing works. Fighting in Asia sucks. This game is not meant to be played this long. That's just a fact. But we'll try a D-Day. That's what we're doing. We're just gonna go out in one big hoorah. All of you are going to be in an army that's going to train. As will all of you, and all of you, and all of you will go into here, into this army, and y'all will hopefully retrain and get back into there. You can go into this army. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we're just losing. Like, what the hell is going on here? This is dumb. I don't get it. This is stupid. Do we have strategic bombers? Can we nuke? Can we nuke stuff? Like, look, we have all of our rockets aiming at Eastern Germany and enemy buildings bombed. Like, they're, they're not doing shit. They're not doing anything. Oh my god. This is annoying. This is annoying. And you know what's gonna happen? Someone, like, one of you crazy mofos is gonna be like, please continue the series! Like, do you really wanna just watch me be salty about the fact that fighting this long ass war is a pain? Do you really wanna watch that? And we're ready to go. We're, we're, I know. Well, no, we, got, we want the paratroopers. We want the paratroopers. So. But, paratroopers are still sailing over. I don't know, y'all. I do not know. What I do know is that this is the end of the episode. So I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like, consider subscribing to the channel, and uh, Ready to move. Yeah, I'm just going to assign everyone to their respective uh, armies. What do we need here? All in. We need basically... Yes, sir. We're going to assign people to their respective armies, and we're going to launch D-Day. And if D-Day succeeds, all we'll in. continue. If D-Day fails, we'll call it a draw. So, hope to uh, see everybody in the next episode. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to leave a like and share subscribing to the channel. Uh, and, uh, yeah, you know, hit the bell and all of those things that us YouTubers tell you to do so you can see more of our videos. Because YouTube hates us and the algorithm sucks. Hope to see everybody in the next one. Until then, thanks for watching. This is Mikey Derpanginator, signing out. See you, nerds.